Hi guys, it's actually sunny. So we've been out um, doing some stuff out here. So we've just made this um, Renew raised bed out of the pallets. So I'll spin you around one sec. Okay, so we've made this. It's so slightly smaller than the last ones because the pallet was slightly smaller. And we've just put some new compost. This is our compost made from the duck and sheep poop and the bedding and stuff. So we've redone this one. It's going to have chard in it. So just redone this one. We're just going to put some more stuff in it as well. And we've just given the stuff we just dug up. Oh yeah, all oh, the gooties are down here. First time they're down here for all the old, all of winter. And hands over there. And I've given them three pals. We're rooting around at the Indigans. Loving it. Hello. Oh, she laid an egg today. It's the first time, little actually, second time possibly. There's one out here the other day. Um, that looked like it was a, a bit of a interesting delivery. So I think that was her first egg, but I think it was the second one today. These little guys. All right, Squatty. Poor little sweetie. Did they pull you away, sweet? Did she? I've given some to the ducks, but the ducks are sleeping in the sunshine and they have not noticed. Hey guys! You okay? Oh, it's a big yarn. So we did go hoose this morning and they decided to come down and Enjoy some of the sunshine today. Down by the summer house. Oh, it's the first time I've seen them down here for ages, so it's lovely. So I've done four trips of compost today, and that's it so far. See you again for you tomorrow. Bye. Yesterday or day before, a little sweet. We put it on there, there, by Fortington. It's sunny again today. Had a frost though this morning, so it's all frosty. It's now all, all the frost is going away. Little wasabi's having a little drinky.
Like, I'm just dissing this out so they're not all squabbling over it. <laughs> Bye. So the sheep all down in the orchard, which is lovely because we've been leaving that door open or the gate open for ages for them to go down there and hopefully eat some of the grass down there, keep it nice and trim and give them all some nice fresh grass. Um, and they're finally down there. They're, they've been down there a few times, but sometimes they go down and they kind of, I'm assuming they think that they're not meant to be down there so they come back out straight away. But they've actually been down there for quite a while now, all eaten away. So, yay, good news. Mum decided that the pumpkin patch was going to get turned into a just basically flowers and make it look pretty out here rather than it being vegetables because we've got so many down in the menage now. So we planted all these, we've got lots of bulbs in there as well, so we're supposed to wait for those to come up. We've also got all the crocuses and stuff that we planted in that first year that are all coming up. We have some over here, we've got all the tulips coming up too. We've got tulips there, some more tulips up here, coming up here, tulips, tulips, the rose hips, we've got buds and all the, um, the ones over here, the raspberries and everything, we've got stuff all over them, we've got crocuses over here and tulips in the tree. We've got tulips here, crocus, tulip, tulip, crocuses. All these trees looking pretty good. More crocuses, more tulips. So everything's coming up. We've got another lovely day for today. I'm probably going to do some more compost shifting. Um, and hopefully the ghosts will come down with us again. Oh uh, yeah. That's Nettle who's shouting. Hi Nettle! Hello everybody! You gonna come down, down the field with us again? Yeah? Right, so I'm gonna go and have some food and then I'll be back out. I just wanna show you. It's all really lovely and pretty out here. Signs of spring. 